Hello, my name is Mike Till, and I am the lead sales engineer here at NOPS. Today, we'll be talking about the AWS's Foundational Technical Review, or FTR for short. What is the FTR? The FTR enables you to identify and remediate risks in your products or solutions. The FTR requires you to meet a specific set of requirements based on the AWS well-architected framework to ensure that your solutions are following AWS best practices related to security, reliability, and operational excellence. Using a tool like NOPS, we can help streamline the assessment process and make sure you are ready to be FTR compliant. Let's dive in. In order to get started with your FTR assessment in NOPS, you first have to define the workload you want to assess. To get there, we will select the Workloads tab, and then we will go ahead and create a brand new workload. We have the ability to define what that is, whether it's one or multiple accounts, services, or VPCs, or even a collection of tags. We also want to select the FTR as the assessment option. You can also select if this is production or pre-production, depending on the environment that you're working with. And then you can add any additional notes here down below for housekeeping purposes. Once you are content with the configuration, you hit save to create the workload. Now that the workload has been created, we can select it to bring us to the summary page of the assessment. Here you can see how many questions you have left unanswered, how many medium or high priority issues there are currently, and how far through the assessment you currently are. Down below, we can attach documents directly to the workload so you can keep everything organized and in one spot. Lastly, the attached resources tab will display all the resources that are currently a part of this workload. To start the assessment, you hit the Start or Update Assessment button, which will bring you to the 14 questions that need to be answered for the FTR. One of the great things about NOPS is that we will auto-answer a good portion of these questions based on what we are seeing from our standard data ingestion. As you can see, heading down to question 6, that is based on CloudTrail, the first part was answered automatically because we don't have CloudTrail enabled on all of our AWS accounts in all regions therefore it was flagged as an issue. For more functionality, you can select the three vertical dots on the right to bring up more options. Show description will give you a more detailed breakdown of what this specific section is looking for. By clicking on View Auto Discovery Details, this will bring up a page that outlines why this was flagged, including the recommendation to fix it, and if you click on the rule itself, it will show you the specific item that is being flagged. Looking back at some of the additional options we have for each section, you also have the ability to add labels, which can help you organize and prioritize what should be tackled first. You can also attach documents, resources, and violations directly to each question as well. And lastly, you can even create JIRA tickets directly from NOPS if you prefer to manage the workflow that way. When wrapping things up, you can add any additional notes. To the questions or even create and add any recommendations you would like to include on the assessment further allowing you to build a roadmap to pass the FTR. Once you have gone through and answered all of the questions, it is time to export the report. You have two different options, either the full report or with just the recommendations only. Today we will look at the full report which will download a PDF for you to review. This gives you a breakdown of each question and where you stand. This also will include AWS's recommendations to fix as well, as well as any that you added personally. The Foundational Technical Review is a great way to ensure that your workloads are adhering to best practices when operating in the cloud. With a focus on security, reliability, and operational excellence, you can feel confident in knowing that your environments are ready for anything. Using a tool like NOPS takes it a step further and ensures that these types of assessments are easy to understand and provide clarity in what needs to be done to pass the FTR. Thank you.